In this video, I'm going to tell you how you can exactly buy the newest approved treatment for hair loss, Cosmo RNA. And for this, we have two methods, one of which you can do immediately, and the second one you have to wait for about two days for it to be completed. And let's uh, start off with the second one, which is buying it from the Amazon UK, the UK version of the website Amazon. And I actually said that with this method, you have to wait about two days because Cosmo RNA is currently not listed on the UK version of Amazon, but that is currently being changed by the Bioneer company. And the CEO of the company actually said that the product is due to be listed on Amazon UK about the 20th of May. So it should have been listed yesterday as of the time i'm recording the video but um it is expected to be listed on monday and some people actually said that it was already listed on uh, friday but it was quickly sold so uh that's one thing to keep in mind buying it from amazon uk next week hopefully but the short way with which you can buy cosmo rna immediately even with us residents which is somewhat of a controversial topic because some people thought this couldn't have been true but um, even us residents can immediately buy and order cosmo rna from the cosmo rna mall and i have a funny story with this um, i made a video about one month ago uh, where i made a little investigation a little effort myself back when nobody knew where cosmo rna was going to be sold or which is uh, its predicted price or uh, the release date and I actually was successful in contacting the company and extracting some information from one employee of Bioneer Engineering and I remember him telling me that Cosmo RNA will be sold on Cosmo RNA Mall and stupid me at the time and I even said this in the video I thought I thought he meant uh, merchandising units the one that you find in big malls we call them in my country kiosk and I received a lot of backlash in the comment section saying how stupid I was but I, I didn't know at the time I didn't know that he meant the CosmoRNA.com website they call that CosmoRNA Mall so uh, my point is you can do it right now you can go to cosmorna.com even from uh, for us residents and you can order cosmorna and buy it immediately and one caveat for uh, us residents there were some rumors about the fact that the fda confiscated the product and some people even ordered it and said that they had the traffic number and uh, the product was stuck and there were some rumors that the fda is the one that's holding the product but that is not true because as of currently uh, 21st of May, uh, we have some US residents that uh, already received their product and uh, began to use it today. And the way that they are using Cosmo RNA is, as we said in previous videos, you will have to use one milliliter. Some people said it's hard to do a full coverage of the scalp with one milliliter. My recommendation is focus on one target area. So if you have for example, I do have thinning area all over my scalp, but my biggest area of interest or biggest area that gives me problem is, is my um, vertex, is my crown area. So if it was me, I would do that one milliliter primarily uh, on my vertex and maybe a little bit on my mid scalp. So I would encourage you guys to do the same thing. Please don't just change the dosage by yourself please don't use two milliliters especially because uh the clinical data that we have assessing the safety which i'm not really happy of but that's a topic for another video but uh, my point is the clinical data that we have is assessing the usage of course RNA one milliliter per two weeks or per one week sorry and the clinical data posted in nature magazine so please do not use more than that one milliliter should be enough try to focus on one target area and try using cosmo rna on one specific area each time don't chase the area each time you're using it one other thing that i wanted to talk about is the updated price in my previous video about cosmo rna where i made that little investigation that i told you about I discussed that or I shared the information that the employee of Bioneer shared with me or disclosed to me um, that the price would be $67 per month and I made a little calculation and if you remember or you can go ahead and watch the video uh, that was the price uh, provided to me by the employee but that came up to not be 100% accurate and uh, the price now is $300 for a three-month supply of Cosmo RNA so 
the cost of actually using this treatment would be $100 per month, which is different from the $67 that I put in my video. And I want to clarify this point, guys, because a lot of people have been telling me on the comment section, I do not have any affiliation with this company. I'm not a company employee. I'm not a company investor. I don't even 100% like the product. And I discussed why in my first video on Cosmo RNA, which you can go ahead and watch, especially when it comes to the safety assessment used in the um, clinical data that was published in Nature magazine. So my point is, I have some criticism of the company. I am far from being uh, or holding any bias towards this particular product. So please guys, keep this in mind. Everything that I share on this channel, I'm not going to pay one cent from uh, the Bioneer Engineering Company or from uh, the Cosmo RNA team. I'm only doing this for you guys and for YouTube <laughs> advertisement. That's the only way that I'm getting paid for. So I'm trying to provide the best service for you guys and the best information for you in the most neutral fashion possible. And aligned with that goal of mine to make the best service for you guys, I wanted to make this little experiment and I talked about it in my previous video. Uh, if you are going to use Cosmo RNA, I please encourage you to send me an email on this email and include photographs of your hair loss, of your current hair loss before using Cosmo RNA and then do follow up photos one month after using it, two months after using it, three months after using it. And if we gather enough people, I will extend the, the period of the or the duration of this experiment for six months so that we can collect this new data that we will have from a lot of users and we can make something out of it. So please, if you're going to use, I'm not, again, I'm not encouraging anyone to buy Cosmo RNA. I'm not encouraging anyone to uh, use Cosmo RNA. I myself, I'm thinking to not even use it. So I'm not in any way, shape or form encouraging any way to buy this product. But if you're going to do it anyways, please do a huge service to the hair loss community and share your data with us so that we can make some value out of it. So again, send me photographs of your hair loss on this email and include uh, basic information like your age, your onset of the hair loss. So uh, at what age did your androgenetic alopecia begin and the current treatments you're taking for hair loss. So include those three basic information and photographs with good camera angle, lighting conditions, and um, good styling of your hair, like you usually do it, and send me those emails, and then send me follow-up emails um, after each month of using Cosmo RNA for six months. And if you're interested in Cosmo RNA or its mechanism of action or its efficacy, which I talked again in big and great details about in that video, uh, my first ever video about Cosmo RNA. Um, again, uh, briefly, Cosmo RNA works with a technology called siRNA, which is um, the abbreviation of small interfering RNA, which is basically a small sequence of genetic material that interferes with the protein th um, synthesis. Sorry, and uh, for this case, that protein that we want to prevent its synthesis is the androgen receptors that is expressed on hair follicles and is the one responsible for binding DHT and uh, the one responsible for the damage that comes to the hair follicle. So by preventing its synthesis on the hair follicle, we basically try to prevent androgenetic alopecia from progressing. And I'm saying progressing, I'm not talking about reversing hair loss, and I'm not talking about um, giving birth to new follicles, I'm talking about preventing advancement of androgenetic alopecia. Keep this in mind. All the treatments that we have currently, 5-AR uh, inhibitors, finasteride, dutasteride, minoxidil, Cosmo RNA have the same common goal, which is slow down or stop, if you're lucky, the progression of your hair loss. Hair loss reversal is just a bonus and it happens in a minority of users of these treatments. And if you're wondering, the efficacy of Cosmo RNA is about 8.1 hairs per square centimeter improvement versus baseline uh, versus placebo, of course, uh, in six months. Uh, if you want to compare that to that of finasteride, finasteride achieved about 9 or 9.5 um, hairs per square centimeter improvement versus baseline uh, in six months. So it achieved 80% of the efficacy of finasteride. That, of course, is from uh, the data presented by the company. 
if you want to know the shortcomings of that particular data and that particular study, uh, like the conflict of interest or the uh, methods used to assess the safety profile of the compound and many other shortcomings that I talked about, please watch my video on customer RNA. It's really interesting and I've put a lot of effort in doing it. Or if you're interested in alternative treatments for regrowing your hair, like pyrolutamide or GT20029 or uh, RU58841, which I'm not encouraging to use any of those, I'm just saying if you're interested, and the data and the facts that we know about these particular compounds and whether they will be approved or um, you should not use it, please binge watch my videos on them. I made a series of videos discussing all of those products, which again, I try to look at the clinical data in a neutral fashion and present it to you guys without any bias. I really don't get paid from anyone besides YouTube, which again, I only got monetized about one week ago. so. Uh, yeah, so if you made it this far into the video, please make sure to press that like button and as always, stay safe.